So this is the Bunsen burner. The Mad Lab Bunsen burner by Softlight. Alright, so got some wax. Stealth Army wax. Tool for the fins, which is pretty cool. I don't have one. These fins. Surfing shouldn't be so hard. One, no screws on deck. Two, bones and shanks fin system. Three, bamboo stringer technology. Damn, this looks so nice. My goodness. See, it's got the no, no fin screws at the back. It's got the, the proper fin capsules. So I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take the plastic off, put the fins in. I'm gonna loosen these up so I can get the fins in. So fin boxes, that's what these were called. That's what that's the word I was trying to think of. Alright, now that they are loosened up, pop these in. Oh, it says the same thing. RF3. <laughs> it must just be what the type of fin. It's raining. Alright, let's tighten these fins back on. Mad Lab Bunsen Burner by Softlight. Now it does, it feels super nice. It's very slick, nice and compact, very stiff. So I am hoping that this is going to last. The last foamy I had, it was kind of cheap, um, but it broke after a month. So I'm hoping this one can last me at least a year. And you guys will know because I'll be writing this in my videos. So I will let you know when it does snap and then you can gauge the durability of this board. But I've got a feeling it's going to go well. <sighs> smells good. Alright, let's wax this bad boy up, shall we? This is hard to wax and film at the same time. Okay, so I'm about to take the board out to Noosa. Um, after the salt, so I'm gonna I'm gonna write it, I'm gonna review it, and I'll let you know how it feels afterwards. So I'll see you out there. Battery's only on one bar. <sighs>
Okay, so final review. So final review of the board. Stop it! Final review of the board. Oh, hello. Hello, Rusty. Final review of the board. Okay, so. Um, obviously first getting onto the board, it took a little while for me to get used to it, but after a few waves, um, it felt great. I could do anything I could do on this board as I could on my fiberglass board. Yeah, I almost, I almost felt like I was surfing better on this board. I think because it's a soft top, I feel more confident doing my turns and stuff. I'm not afraid of the board hitting me and getting hurt. Um, so overall, I was surfing better on this board. Um, I did notice when I was trying to pump down the line of the waves, it was a little bit slow. That's probably understandable when I've when I've been riding a short performance fiberglass board, which is very fast down the line. So it did make a bit of a difference. However, I didn't feel the board bending once. When I was pumping, when I was doing my bottom turns, when I was doing the snaps, I didn't feel the belt. I didn't feel the board bend once, which is great. Um, so because of the board being very stiff and not bending, I could really get those turns properly. Um, I noticed there were some dents on the tail of the board, but that's understandable because I was digging my knee into the tail when I was doing my duck dives. There are a few pretty heavy closeouts, so I really had to try and get the board under. Um, but even while doing that, pushing the board down with my knee and my hands, there was no bend still, so duck diving worked really well. But yeah, I'm sure sometime in the future it is going to start bending. It's kind of inevitable when, with these soft tops, that's just what happens. General wear and tear um, usage of the board, eventually it'll just start to bend and hopefully it takes a while, um, but we'll see. I'm going to keep riding this board, um, I'll keep filming. So we'll see how long the boat we'll see how long the board actually lasts. But yeah, I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. Um, I hope it does help. Maybe you will try this board out for yourself. Overall, overall, it was very fun. It was very good. Um, it did take a bit to get used to, like I said before, but once I was used to it, excellent. So I can't wait to ride this board in some better surf. Um, and even bad surf. Hopefully it'll be fun. But like I, like I said, hope you enjoyed. See you in the next video.